Hi, I'm Anthony. I work here in the demo room in Kennesaw, and I'm going to show you how to do uh, a warm-up procedure on your versifier in the morning when you come in. The first thing we're going to do is load the file into the software and here's the file right here. It's just a bunch of color bars it looks like with a test form at the bottom so if you're able to read the test form. So the first thing I'm going to do is come into skilled operator. I'm going to go to 201 and I'm just going to do a color registration um, to get the colors to register sheet to sheet. Now this is just a fast little calibration it does. There's no paper involved. The other procedure we used to do was a 201 adjust color density and we don't want to do that anymore before or after the printed samples of what to warm up the machine. So once it's done we're going to hit submit and we're going to print 35 sheets. If it goes longer than 24 hours, you need to increase this volume roughly by 50 sheets. Okay, once it's done, we'll hit OK. So once we start printing the targets, we'll get it out the back. Okay, so now it's printing, staging the paper. So we'll take our first sheet out, the rest of the sheets will come out. We'll look at it, see if we got any bands or streaks or anything like that, front or back. Everything looks pretty good. We'll wait for the last sheet to come out. And then we'll look at and compare the first and last sheet together. So now we have the last one out. They look pretty good. They're really not, they look pretty even. Okay, so now what we'll do is we'll go through how to do the calibration. We'll open up the calibration manager. We'll grab our paper. We'll hit calibrate. Automatic inline sensor. We'll hit calibrate inline. And now we'll do the calibration and it'll run out to the top of the stack of tray. And that'll be two sheets coming out. And we tend to calibrate three different papers, a gloss stock, a plain paper, and a matte paper. So in this case, we're only going to do one right now. Okay. Once done, we'll just apply the calibration, close out of the manager, and we're ready to now do our live job. So what I like to do is I like to warm up my machine on a gloss paper. It tends to hold the toner better than the, than the uncoated when, when warming up. Um, you can warm up with any sheet, but it just seems to look prettier with the uh, coated paper. It is possible that you can uh, redo your color profiles when, when after doing this. So you'll see a change from your old procedure to your new procedure by doing this uh, new warm up. Yes, there's no difference in what we do. It's the calibration, the warm up procedure, it's the machine itself that we're really warming up, not the software. Same procedure, you might want to build something for your fifth color if you're getting ready to use your fifth color. You can also use this for a CV and a CP also, the same procedure. Thank you for joining me today, and if you have any other questions, you can email us at info at heidelberg.com.